How to Code Open-Ended Questions in SBSS If you're working with survey data and wondering how to make sense of those open-ended questions in SPSS, you're in the right place. Let's break it down step by step. First, understand that open-ended questions give respondents the freedom to answer in their own words, which can be rich in detail but challenging to analyze. To tackle this, you'll need to use SBSS's text analytics capabilities. Preparing your data. Start by ensuring your data is properly set up in SBSS. If your survey data is in a spreadsheet, import it into SBSS. Make sure each open-ended question is in a separate column and each row represents a respondent. Using SBSS Text Analytics. SBSS offers a powerful tool called Text Analytics for Surveys. This tool can automate the coding process, saving you a lot of time. Here, how you can use it. Go to the Analyze menu, then select Text Analytics and choose Text Analytics for Surveys. Select the open-ended question you want to analyze and click Next. SBSS will analyze the text responses, extracting key concepts and word patterns. It will then categorize these into themes or codes. Automated coding. The text analytics tool uses advanced linguistic theories to analyze the text. It can automatically create categories based on the responses. You can fine-tune these categories manually if needed. This ensures that the same response is categorized consistently every time, reducing the risk of human error. Manual coding. If you prefer manual coding, you can do so by creating a coding frame. Here's Hugranung Pmujafun your codes. These could be based on themes you expect to find in the responses or derived from the data itself through inductive coding. Assign codes. Go through each response and assign the appropriate code. You can use a flat coding frame, which is simpler but less powerful, or a hierarchical frame, which allows for more detailed coding. Ensuring consistency. Consistency is key when coding open-ended questions. To ensure this, you can use the test street test method or the independent coder method. In the test street test method, the same person codes the data twice without looking at the previous results. In the independent coder method, a second coder works on the same survey, and then the results are compared for consistency. Logging decisions. To maintain accuracy, log all your decisions and thoughts during the coding process. This helps if you need to review or adjust your codes later. It also ensures that your coding can be backed up with evidence. Final steps. Once you've coded your open-ended questions, you can analyze the data just like you would with numerical data. Use SPSS to generate reports and visualizations that help you understand the themes and patterns in the responses. By following these steps, you can effectively code and analyze open-ended questions in SPSS, unlocking valuable insights from your survey data.